Breaking news in the investigation of the CTA Green Line derailment that sent seven people to the hospital. Investigators just telling us human error is to blame. CBS 2's Megan Hickey has been following this story from the beginning and joins us live from the newsroom with what we've learned about those at fault, Megan. Erica, the CTA says two signal maintainers and a rail operator were to blame for the scary derailment that left 30 passengers stranded for hours, more than 20 feet above the ground. The front car was tilted precariously to one side. CBS 2 was first on the scene as terrified passengers were extracted from the stalled train over a period of about five hours and lowered safely to the ground. Fortunately, the seven passengers who were transported to the hospital sustained only minor injuries. But passengers remembered seeing CTA workers on the tracks and questioned if they had anything to do with the accident. There were actually workers that were basically witnessed it as it happened. Now CTA is telling us two signal maintainers were stationed there and had moved a switch from its normal position to a reverse position. So the tracks weren't aligned when the train hit this spot just north of the 47th Street Green Line station. CTA says the maintainers were disciplined for not setting the switch in the correct alignment. They received a 10-day suspension without pay. They've been placed on six months probation and they were given written warnings. As for the train operator, the CTA tells us they're still reviewing the operator's role in this incident. They will pursue any discipline in accordance with the union contract. A spokesperson says the operator has been off work since the derailment and they'll take final action when that employee returns to work. And the CTA declined our request for an on-camera interview. We also reached out to the CTA Employees Union for comment. So far, no response. Live in the newsroom, Megan Hickey, CBS 2 News.